Give it up for mic adjustment. Oh my God. I stopped saying the Pledge of Allegiance in school. Why? Because it's hard to put your heart in the palm of a country's hand that is wearing brass knuckles without expecting it to clench a fist and watch the blood drip from brass brutality and run on side streets where it remains unnamed. I've heard it said that orange is the new black. But current events speak in whispers and tell all they do not say outright between the screams of civilians and the injustice that blurs my eyes when I read the news sneaked between every black line of print. Those whispers aren't soft anymore. They scream at the world, shrieking, black is the new prison orange. Black is the new red worn on the lips with enough to Black is the new red worn on the lips of those with enough to lose that they can afford it. Black is the new purple and the bruises spattered across the brow and jaw of liberty. Black is the new orange and the shots fired on innocent protesters. Black is the new orange. Ferguson is the naughty word nowadays that brings red rage to a boil in every man's throat and brings disapproving glares to faces that have no eyes. The bruises Liberty sports now are bleeding under the limelight, gruesome enough to make the crowd gasp. There are a thousand years between the yells to help him and the time it takes for the ref to even look at the wounds closely enough to decide if they're enough to end the match. But within a thousand years, there is certainly enough time to issue a finishing blow, a sweep from under the knees, and a final punch to the nose. The opponent's brass knuckles glint under the bright glow with rosy blood, the fist is tugging against the meager air resistance. The leg is coming under the knees. This crowd is screaming in agony. And the ref hasn't even turned around. Back roads run red. Street lights glow orange. Shadows sit in sidewalk cracks. But when the sun rises bright with a golden badge in the morning, red runs to none. Shadows are pulled inside out to reveal happy faces and dull cow eyes. But within a harmless exterior, a darkness still lies. <laughs>